right now, right this minute, tens of thousands of Americans are experiencing a nationwide cellular outage. Phones aren't ringing, text messages aren't sending, data is down. Some phones are showing SOS only. If this isn't a wake-up call for communications preparedness, I don't know what is. Let's talk about the breaking news. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Hamshack TV. I'm your host, Josh AA4WX. We have a breaking news story. Thanks for tuning in. I hope you're doing okay today. Today's video is brought to you by Ham Radio Prep, hamradioprep.com. I'll talk more about them in a little bit, but we need to talk about the importance of amateur radio, and today is a great example of why. Earlier today, on January 14th, 2026, a major cellular outage hit Verizon's network. I personally am a Verizon customer and am being impacted by this right now. This outage impacts voice and data services nationwide. Reports showed millions of users saw their phones switch to SS, or excuse me, SOS mode and losing connectivity across cities like New York, Chicago, Houston, Atlanta, Los Angeles, and Washington, D.C., along with others. I myself am seeing the SOS message. I uh, cannot make a phone call or text unless I'm on Wi-Fi. Verizon has acknowledged the disruption and said its engineers are working on a fix. But as of this broadcast, service has not fully been re restored. I myself still don't have service. Some emergency alerts have warned that 911 connectivity could be compromised for affected users. This is not a regional event. It's nationwide. And it's not only Verizon, there has been some reports with AT&T and T-Mobile, as well as U.S. Cellular as well. So let's talk uh, more here. Our modern world relies heavily on centralized infrastructure, cell towers, backbone networks, core switches, software routing logic. When that infrastructure fails, millions of people lose their primary means of communication instantly. This is not hypothetical. This is happening right now. And it's precisely the scenario ham radio operators talk about when we say redundancy matters. Decentralization matters. <clears throat> Amateur radio was not designed to replace cell networks. It was designed so that in exactly these kinds of failures, we still have a way to communicate. Hams can talk. I've been talking tonight on local VHF and UHF. You can communicate locally. You can communicate regionally. You can also communicate even globally through methods like HF. Without relying on cell phone towers or centralized switching, I might add. Simply RF. Unlike commercial infrastructure, which funnels traffic through choke points that can fail, Ham radio is dispersed, peer-to-peer, -peer, and can operate with basic power sources. In past disasters, from hurricanes to blackouts, amateur radio has plugged the gap when phones and internet went dark. Today's outage is a reminder that no matter how advanced our networks get, they remain vulnerable. Right now, we are seeing phones stuck in SOS mode. Disrupted voice, text, and data across the country. 911 warning, warnings in some urban areas. All because of a network failure. This may take hours to resolve. This happened about 12 o'clock Eastern time, my time zone. And as of this recording at 745, it's still not resolved. These are not fringe reports. These are widespread disruptions. And while most people don't carry an HF radio in their pocket like they do a smartphone. This is exactly why preparedness matters. For most folks, ham radio seems like a niche, a hobby, a pastime. But today in real time, we're watching infrastructure people depend on, that we depend on go dark. Let me repeat this. When phones and cellular networks fail, ham radio still works. That is not an opinion. That is the how the technology was designed to function and demonstrated through decades of real-world events. 
Now, you may be asking me, if you're coming to the channel, you're not a ham radio operator, you may be like, okay, I need to have a backup in case this happens again. So I want to talk about my friends at Ham Radio Prep. Today's video is brought to you by Ham Radio Prep, and it is the simplest way to get your ham radio license or upgrade your ham radio license. If you want to be someone who can communicate when everything else fails, it starts with understanding how to operate correctly, legally, and effectively. Down in the link or down in the description, you'll find a link to hamradioprep.com. And if you use my coupon code HAMSHACKTV, you get 10% off. They're already great prices. And they're so confident they can help you get your license or upgrade. They do offer a money back guarantee. You'll see the website for details, hamradioprep.com. Because getting license isn't just a hobby today, it's a preparedness tool. If your phones are down where, are, where you live, drop a comment with your city or your region. You, know, you don't have to get specific, but let me know if you were impacted by today's, uh, by today's outage. And if you don't mind, what carrier are you using? Let us know what services are working and what are not working. Also, folks, if you would, please hit that like and subscribe button if you're new here. Uh, we appreciate you tuning in. Hit the subscribe button for more content from Hamshack TV. And if you just hit that thumbs up button down below, that helps the YouTube algorithm know to push out uh, the video to more and more people. So hit that like button if you believe we all should be prepared uh, for backup communication failures. Also, again, appreciate you watching. Check out hamradioprep.com. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to join us tomorrow night, tomorrow night at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. We'll be doing Ham Shack TV Live tomorrow night. We're talking about digital modes, and these digital modes are not dependent on cell phones necessarily. So come back, check us out live here on Ham Shack TV with all the panelists. We'll be right here 8 o'clock Eastern Time. Hope you're having a great day. We will get through this outage together. Hopefully Verizon and the other carriers get everything resolved soon. 73. AA4WX WSCB 693.